We have a new baby. Yes. Um, I've had this baby for quite a while, but I've not used it. So today we're going to do something because I've been seeing a lot of atrocities online. <laughs> Forgive me. So I've been seeing a lot of complaints about breastfeeding, nipple cracking, neck pain, back pain during breastfeeding. And so I have to bring out our baby today to demonstrate something. Okay. So today I'll be demonstrating how to properly breastfeed a baby. So you don't get back pain, nipple cracking, irritations, or whatever that you feel during breastfeeding. This is one of the reasons why we and say oh breastfeeding is hard it's traumatizing it cracks your nipple it's painful no remember that i'm not just speaking as a medical doctor i'm also speaking as a mom okay breastfeeding wasn't designed to be painful or to be as traumatizing as you experienced it and i'm going to show you how to properly breastfeed your baby without feeling traumatized hi i am dr ifna ibeze and if you're interested in Fertility, preconception, pregnancy, and early child care tips. Then subscribe to my YouTube channel and click the notification button to know when I post my videos. Today I'm going to show you how to properly position yourself and position your baby during breastfeeding. Breastfeeding starts with you properly positioning yourself. Some women, when they want to breastfeed their baby, they bend, they slouch like this. No, you don't bend while you're breastfeeding your baby because as they are bending, you're bending your neck, you're bending your shoulder, and you're bending your back. This is going to lead to backache, neck pain, and general body pain, which is not good. So what you want to do first of all, when you want to breastfeed, is to get a comfortable chair to sit down. Especially a chair that has an armrest, you know, you can rest your arm. A very comfortable chair that your back is straightened, you know. <laughs> that your back is straightened. See the way I am sitting, I'm sitting very upright. If you are finding it difficult to get a chair, that, your, that can straighten your back. What you need to do is to get an extra pillow and add to your back, okay? So that your back will be straight. There's no reason for you to bend. We have assumed a very comfortable position because breastfeeding is mother first, okay? We have assumed a very comfortable position. The next thing to do is to carry your baby. So this is your baby. You lift your baby to, to here. The baby is going to be like this. You know this, this, my door is very small. So you lift your baby. The back of your baby here, the back of, of the head of your baby, okay, is going to be on your elbow. This is your elbow joint. It's going to be on your elbow. Then your palm is going to be under the baby's bum bum. Okay. So you lift, you see, the head is here. You lift the baby to your chest. So the way I usually explain this in our accidental class is take the baby to the breast, not the breast to the baby. Take the baby to the breast. Don't take the breast to the baby. When you take the breast to the baby, you will sludge, you will bend, and you feel pain, and you'll be struggling. But when you take the baby, position the baby very well, lift the baby up to your comfortable position. You see that you don't have any reason for you to bend your neck or this thing. All you have to do is just to, you see it? Very comfortable. And if you even need extra support, put a nursing pillow below your arm, and you're comfortable. So when you're you have position your baby like this because the back of your baby's neck is on your elbow it's going to tilt like this and open up your baby's mouth so um you just have to then you squeeze your nipple and make sure it enters into the mouth of the baby make sure that your baby does not st start suckling until the, the whole part of the nipple has entered into his mouth with the black part with the black part the part of the areola what some of you do is that you just leave the baby to suck in, suck in the nipple alone as that, and that is where the pain, ah, the pain will enter your head and it's going to make you go crazy. Okay, make sure that you are in charge, that you are in control of what is happening during breastfeeding. Hold your baby position very well and put the baby to rest. Fold, your attention should be on your nipple, fold it, gently open the baby's mouth and make sure you push it inside very well with the black spot before you allow the baby to start sucking anything outside this you are going to have nipple cracks and irritation and it's going to lead to more pain it can even get infected and lead to infection of the breast you know that can land you in the hospital all right so in summary make sure that you position yourself first position yourself first upright position neck straighten back straighten hip straightened carry position your baby on your shoulder use your your palm to support the bum bum and lift the baby to the breast never you take the breast to the baby it's going to cause you a lot of pain
I hope you have you have been able to get one or two tips to help you to breastfeed your baby properly. If you need a detailed illustration or more information about breastfeeding and how to do that, and other information on child care that you will need as a new mom, check out the description. I'm going to link my book, The First Time Mom, which explains all of these things in details. Trust me, you're going to thank yourself for getting it. Okay? See you in my next video. Don't forget to subscribe and like this video. Bye!